Welcome to our course, of Revit Structural Detailing 2019. For designing and detailing of steel structures. This time, we bring you a step-by-step -step course, for the designing, detailing and structural integrity validation, of steel structures and their connections. Meaning, and beyond the simple drawing and drafting of the structure, this step-by-step -step course, will enable you to perform the integrity check of the connections in your structure, based upon the internal forces present across the members, such as those of the bending moment, shear and axial force. Furthermore this checking of the connections, will consider both the American and the European design code. And thus, this step-by-step -step course, will help you to achieve an accurate and safe design of the connections, so you can confidently fabricate them in the shop. For this purpose, or for obtaining the precise values of these forces, we'll briefly cover the integration of Revit structure, with Robot Structural Analysis Professional. Meaning, that we'll use Robot Structural Analysis Professional, as a tool for finding the values of the bending moment, shear and axial forces. In this way and during this course of Revit structure, we'll approach the designing of steel structures integrated by both commercial profiles and trusses. Taking a close look at the detailing of all the required connections. Using both the catalog of Revit structure, and the designing of custom connections. Moreover, we'll take a closer look at many of the available tools for editing and adjusting the components in the structure, so you can achieve a detailed and precise design. And once we've achieved such design, we'll begin with the generation of all the detail drawings. Placing labels, dimensions, descriptions, and all the necessary information for fabricating our structure in the shop. Including the generation of the bill of materials of the project. And so during this course, we'll begin with the designing and detailing of a steel frame structure. Placing all the required columns and beams according to the design specifications. And once we obtain the first frame of the structure, we'll start with the designing of its connections, proposing a first design. But again, and beyond the mere drawing and drafting of the connections, we'll verify if that particular design, is actually correct and sufficient, in relation to both the internal forces produced across the members of the structure, and the needed design code. And for which we'll consider both the American, and European design codes for steel construction. Since this step will allow you to achieve a realistic design of the connections, which could be fabricated and assembled in the shop. Moreover, and for performing this verification with whole precision, we'll make sure that the sections of both columns and beams, present the correct structural properties. And once we've attained an efficient and safe design of the frames, we'll continue with the development of the remaining aspects of the structure, such as the placement of purlins and bracing systems. And for this purpose, we'll approach the subject of creating custom connections. And having completed the design of the structure, we'll proceed with the development of the multiple detail drawings. From those pertaining to the structure's overall design, to those of the connections. Displaying all the dimensions, details, labels and descriptions. And in addition, and once we've got more familiar with Revit Structures tools, we'll begin with the designing and detailing of a more complex structure or a structure integrated by trusses columns and beams, and which will allow us to further advance in the subject, of the development of custom connections, but also of many of the editing tools of Revit structure, performing cuts and similar adjustments across the members of our structure. Finally, and once we've completed the design of the structure and subsequent detail drawings, we will take care of generating the project's bill of materials. Thus obtaining the list of all the components and assemblies in the structure. And so during this comprehensive course, we'll make a thorough description of all these steps, going from the designing of structures integrated by steel frames and trusses, the generation of the detail of the anchors, purlins and bracing systems, to the checking of the design of the connections, for either the American or the European design code. And for which we'll produce all the needed detail drawings, and bill of materials so you can send your design to the shop for its fabrication and assembly. So, all these topics, will be widely covered in this step-by-step -step course, of Revit Structural Detailing 2019. For designing and detailing of steel structures. Moreover, and through our support center, you'll count with the assistance of experts while you study and practice. So you can apply your new skills to your own projects without limits.